one, go! placed first. Three, two, one, go! Congratulations, you're the winner! One 
County. I'm heading back to base. You've won the race!
Riverside Avenue.
Auto Log Alert. Pursuing its goal of creating the ultimate road-going sports car, McLaren Cars spared no expense and drew upon its vast Formula One racing knowledge to create the spectacular McLaren F1, a super light, high-performance car which employs some of the most cutting-edge technologies and materials in the industry. Built on an incredibly strong and ultralight carbon composite chassis, the F1's potent BMW V12 engine, producing 627 horsepower, is capable of propelling this car to a stunning 231 mile per hour top speed, earning it the distinction of being the fastest production sports car in the world. For improved grip and handling, the F1 employs a complex system of airflow management, electric fans, and a brake activated rear foil, whose combined effects literally suck the car to the ground at high speeds. Carrying a staggering 540,000 pound sticker price, the McLaren F1 is the most expensive production road car in the world. But for drivers that demand ultimate performance and can afford the price, few cars can match either its speed or acceleration. Although founded in 1989, the history of McLaren cars actually began decades earlier during the outstanding racing career of the late Bruce McLaren. Born in New Zealand in 1937, Bruce McLaren began his foray into automotive racing at the youthful age of 14 when his father gave him an aging 24 horsepower 1929 Austin 7 Ulster racer. Using the old Austin 7, the young McLaren began to learn about racing and engineering. In 1959, he became the youngest driver to ever win a Grand Prix, a milestone which was to set the tenor for the remainder of his career. With the formation of Bruce McLaren Motor Racing in 1964, he and his team began their conquest of Formula One and founded a dynasty which stands to this day. McLaren also dreamt of producing a road-going sports car, 
but sadly, he was killed in a tragic testing accident in 1970. Yet his dream and the team lived on, dominating the sport and becoming the most successful Grand Prix team ever in 1993. McLaren Cars was formed in 1989 with a simple mission statement. Build the ultimate road-going sports car. Drawing on McLaren's rich Formula One heritage and technology base, the company, under the guidance of technical director Gordon Murray and his team, crafted a dream into reality. In 1994, the company launched their first production road car, the McLaren F1. Pursuing its goal... Pursuing its goal. The McLaren F1 GTR has been a dominating force in sports car racing since 1995 when it won the great Le Mans 24-hour race first time out. No make of car had ever achieved this remarkable feat in its first year of production. Not surprisingly, the F1 GTR has been described as one of the great sports racing cars of all time. The F1 is arguably the most visually attractive of all rivals in the lofty supercar class with its spelt carbon fiber bodywork and unusual cockpit which locates the driver centrally. McLaren is one of the most successful race car constructors ever and has won numerous championships in Grand Prix, Can-Am and sports car racing since its founding by New Zealander Bruce McLaren in 1963. After his tragic death in a race car testing accident in 1970, the firm under Ron Dennis's vision went on to become one of the most successful Formula One teams in history and continues dominating Formula One today. The McLaren GTR is a highly modified version of the F1 road car and is powered by a sophisticated 6.1 liter BMW V12, which propels the lightweight racer through the gears at astonishing speeds. It also boasts outstanding reliability to handle the demands of endurance racing. McLaren built 28 GTRs between 1995 and 1997, with horsepower figures ranging from 600 to 640. Suspension was upgraded to handle the demands of racing, but the basic design of the road-going F1 was the key to this car's amazing record.
Designed by Gordon Murray, the McLaren F1 held the record for the fastest production car in the world for seven years. There may be faster cars, but the McLaren F1 is still the fastest naturally aspirated production car, with a speed of 240 miles per hour set on March 31st, 1998. Weighing only 1,140 kilograms and incorporating a specially built 6.1 liter V12 from BMW, the McLaren F1 is able to achieve speeds of 240 miles per hour due to its refined aerodynamics and incredible attention to detail. With no power steering or assisted braking, the car demands a lot from its driver, but will also reward them with a unique driving experience. There are a lot of unique features for the McLaren F1 that are added, purely for their focus on driver and performance, like the central seating position, gold leaf-lined engine bay, this was for heat dissipation. Only 64 of the standard road-going version were made, which has pushed the price of owning one upwards of twice the original asking price.